drugs. Are you on drugs? No, of course not. What do you, what do you mean, of course not? What are you saying? What, you, you don't believe me or something? Tracy, my philosophy is to be brutally honest with my patients. And especially my adolescent patients is a way to build trust. I want you to trust me, Tracy, because I care about you. Do you trust me, Tracy? Your parents are concerned. Attitude is history. Delusional. Tendencies toward borderline personality disorder. Borderline personality disorder. They think you're smoking crack. crack. Well, my parents are lying. That's. There's no reason for parents to lie. How do I know what motivates me? Tracy, as your psychiatrist, I'm of the opinion that you might think you want to get better, but you don't really want to get better. No, 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 I do. I do, I do, I want to get better. Why are you resisting me? No, 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 I, I'm, I'm not, I'm not resisting You're you. You're doing it right now. Well, then tell me what to do. I can't do that. Well, then how am I supposed to stop resisting you? I can't tell you that. Well, I can't have this conversation anymore. It's... Can't is a choice. Okay, okay. Am I resisting you now? Are you? Dr. Hecker, my psychiatrist. She only cares about the, like, 80 bucks an hour she's paid or whatever to prevent me from turning into a psycho. Well, it's kind of too late for that. When things happen to people, they radiate a light. Because they've got a picture caught inside them. Because they were there, and you weren't. And because you've only got a piece. And because all you can do is shrink and blow up that one tiny piece.